All right, hey there, Proxius. This is Proxy here, and guys, welcome back to another episode of Explorers of Sky. And in the previous episode, guys, we have made it here to the lower part of Spring Cave. We had went through different levels of Spring Cave in the previous episode, and we were trying to haunt, uh, or we're trying to hunt down Haunter. And uh, basically, every single time that we knocked him out, he would keep on coming back. But all of a sudden, uh, so Flora's got like some, uh, got um got an interesting way on on knowing on how to uh, knock out haunter here from from uh, from him doing his little uh, flash uh, thing to make him uh, come back uh, uh, come back out, out of uh, out of his knockout uh, position uh, so also too also hope you guys are having a good Tuesday out here just let you guys know that there will be an Oracle of ages uh, video coming out tomorrow uh, hopefully uh, hopefully this time I don't uh, I don't have another uh, frustration moment again uh, from from the, from that uh, previous uh, video that I tried to record out with uh, with uh, Oracle of Ages because that game is pretty frustrating. I have to say, like when you get into like the later uh, points of of uh, Legend of Zelda Oracle of Ages, it gets a little bit uh, frustrating because of the whole annoying Goron dance and all of that stuff that was going on. It was just way too annoying. But if you guys have never uh, played um, Oracle of Ages uh, before. Uh, I have to say, I recommend you guys uh, checking that game out. It's actually really fun. Uh, I believe it's out for the Game Boy Color uh, that, that, that originally uh, came out for it. Oh man, we got some annoying uh, Harris's out here. And uh, I, I think I actually have a good uh, comment question of the day here for you guys. And uh, I was wondering, uh, I, I don't know if anybody has ever uh, talked about this comic question of the day before, but um, if you actually had to go and create your own uh, status effect, which being like, um, like, like, like a paralysis, like, 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 since, like, the status conditions that we have now, since, like, we have, like, paralysis and, uh, and, like, poison and all that, what type of, uh, what type of other status element would you want to create, uh, for, uh, for uh, for any of the other new Pokemon uh, that that have a different, I guess, a, a, an element that or a status condition that uh, that they don't have yet. Cause cause that's a little bit of a hard question for me. Cause I wouldn't really know uh, what what new status element that uh, that I would want to create for a Pokemon. Because like I think we already got like all the good stash elements that I think that we have already for for the Pokemon games now okay so let's see another razor leaf on this nice and Beldum is down thank you for that and let's go and head on into B3 oh man okay now you're not playing around here are you Zubat now there is some golden mask here, which that is pretty handy uh, if we wanted to get uh, get ourselves a, a new teammate or not. Oh no! All right. Well, first of all, I'm putting you to sleep because that meditate is going to be a problem. Now you may probably go out for a self destruct, and I don't really trust you. Oh no! Another monster house, of course. All right, guys. So we finally made it out of there, the Spring Cave Pit, and thank God, no more monster houses. Ugh. Yeah, unfortunately, I did have to go down on that annoying monster house. So, hey, you become uh, more persistent than anyone else who's tried to catch me. You're ridiculously stubborn, but still completely useless. So don't you get it? I'm invincible. I have. I have no proof that you're not invincible. What? There's no such thing as an invincible Pokemon. It was nothing but a ruse. Just from the beginning. It wasn't invincibility or anything else. It uh, was it, guys. What, guys? What do you mean? You found this out? Yes. I figured it out. Uh, there isn't just one of you. Come on out. The rest of you. Oh. Oh, man. So there was three haunters. Oh, you. I knew it. There isn't just one haunter. There's three. That time... Ah, uh, so it was just only one. So, so every haunter that we faced, it was, uh, it was a different haunter. 
So for a moment I couldn't see a thing, and that was was it uh, that you changed places. You uh, disorient your opponents with a blinding light, while you two that were hidden would come out. Oh, interesting. Okay, so you hide the hunter who fainted, and then why you would uh, uh, feign innocence and prevent to be the hunter who fainted? Interesting. Okay. So, oh my gosh, it was so bright, I can't see a thing. Uh, what? I just, I knew that I just knocked him out. Why is he suddenly fine? Did you see that? It's impossible to knock me out. That's how you got everyone to think that you were the invincible haunter. The expiration teams that have challenged you so far, haunter. That moment that you believed that you were invincible, haunter, they lost the will to fight. That's why the expiration team were unable to apprehend haunter. So you've been deceiving exploration teams after exploration team that way until now. That's how you always escape. Looks like we found out. Uh, now that our secret has been discovered, we can't let you return. Whoa. What the heck? What's going on here? Oh, man. An eruption. Ah. Oh, no. We're on fire again. All right. This is not good. Lava flows directly beneath. Uh, you've been incredibly persistent. Know that you, we ran here. Uh, it's the best place to knock out grass type Pokemon like you. Brace yourself. Oh no. Oh, now here comes Loudred to save the day. Are you alright, Sephora? What? What were you doing here? Forget that. Here they come. Look out. Uh, this is hot. Alright, so we got ourselves Loudred on the field here. So let's actually uh, quickly save here. There we go. Thank you! Oh my goodness! Oh, thank you! The Haunters are down, man. Jeez. That was the most insane fight that I have ever came across to. That is, like, the second worst compared to the Minetric Gang fight. Oh my lord. Holy. I do not want to go through the Spring Cave ever again. Too many monster houses. Too many insane, annoying... Pokemon around there. Just absolutely crazy. Thank God. We, we we completed out the special episode, and that's all that I can ever ask for. So, uh, so Flora, this is a thank you from me. Nice. We got ourselves a Sun Scarf. A Sun Scarf? Uh, this will help me against Fire type Pokemon damage. Uh, this exclusive item is a great treasure. Oh, I'm so happy. Well, that's good. Well, then, thank you for your assistance. And off goes Magnezone, one of my favorite Pokemon. Can't wait till we see him again. Attention, thanks to Sunflora, she accomplished this arrest. You really did a great job. Yeah, I have to say, we really did a great job. We, oh, oh man, I thought I was going to be stuck on that Haunter, uh, on, on that Haunter, uh, gang fight for, for a while. Uh, he neglected, uh, his gatekeeper's duty for the, uh, for the day and sneaked away somewhere to slack off. Huh? So, he, so as a punishment, I sent him to the Apple Woods to fetch some perfect apples. Well, I was, Chacha didn't really ask you to come and help me. Uh, that's not true, Chacha. Huh? What? What is it? The truth is, Loudred. Yeah, he actually uh, saved us. What? Is that right? If that's the case, then Loudred also deserves recognition. I need to thank him. What? Golly, what is it? Uh, guild rules are strict. The fact that Loudred left his own post remains unchanged. A punishment is a punishment. Loudred's already left for Applewoods, and he's already have to uh, harvest perfect apples for today. But that fight, though, with the Haunter gang is absolutely annoying because, first of all, uh, you actually uh, you are actually burned, so you get burn damage uh, from uh, f like like on the on the battlefield. But also, too, Loudred is a horrible, horrible companion, I have to say, with this whole special episode thing, because he did not do anything, like, good at all. That's why I kept on dying so much in that, in that, in that, uh, Haunter gang fight. Just remembering, uh, was scary. I wonder if he's still gathering perfect apples. I really need to apologize and thank you, but before I didn't want to go to the dungeons with you at all, I'm afraid I kind of blurted out things like that. 
and I'm really sorry for what I said, so I wish I could take all that back. I wonder if you'll go to the dungeons with me in the future. I wonder if we could be friends again. Anyway, as soon as Roger is back, I'm going straight to him to apologize. So I gotta tell him what I couldn't say then. So thank you. And there we go, guys. Another episode of of that is now completed. So uh, I guess I'm just going to end it off here. Uh, so that was part two of episode three of the special episode. We only got two more special episodes left, guys. We got Team Charm coming. And we also got uh, the Primal Dialga fight once again. So we're getting close to, uh, to almost finishing off Explorers of Sky for good now. So uh, I'll see you guys next time. And peace.